On the back side of the 2004 issue of the Canadian $20 bill, there was a quote from French-Canadian novelist Gabrielle Roy, and she asked, Could we ever know each other in the slightest without the arts? When Terry Reed and I started out at art school, the beat generation was in full swing, and the freedom inherent in the beat lifestyle really appealed to many of us, the freedom to explore a creative life. That violin, cried Chagall's mother. But he kept right on painting and became famous and kept on painting the horse with violin in mouth. And when he finally finished it, he jumped up upon the horse and rode away, waving the violin. And then, with a low bow, gave it to the first naked nude he ran across and there were no strings attached. Terry has exhibited in many art galleries, and that includes his performance art pieces. And he invited many artists from around the world to show in exhibitions that he organized and promoted. The Inch Art Show, The Mask Show, Art Core Meltdown, and The Secrets Exchange Exhibition. And in this video, you'll see artwork sent in by artists invited into those exhibitions. Plus, I thought I'd throw in some favorite music and a bit of poetry as well. Terry Reed. Yeah, Br'er Dog, Brother Dog, Br'er Rabbit. That's the uh, how the name was devised. But that was done first, I believe it was in 1976. I was organizing a very large participational exhibition based on the idea of masks, mask show, mask show. Mask show was the name of the exhibition. And this was a kind of uh, a mask, Dalmatian mask. Uh, Eat art, dog face! <laughs> Chiba, 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 chiba
like this when we waltz into this place a couple of far out cats is doing an aztec two-step and i says dad let's cut but then this dame comes up behind me see and says you and me could really exist wow i says only the next day she has bad teeth and really hates poetry about the middle-aged guy busking on Robson Street, Vancouver's little golden mile, part of the souvenir district. Guy middle-aged and gray-haired, whopping out blue suede shoes as I go into the drugstore to post a letter to Maggie and Oz. Coming back past the blonde mystic with the dove and the cockatoo, unique spiritual readings for a dollar a minute whose goose have disappeared one into a coyote's belly and the survivor into the animal hospital. Five motorcycles spill away from the curb, uh, drowning out the jug boys. The funny one with the normal hair calls out to the crowd, replay on the motorcycle, then adds, arrest that smell. The kids from Iceland watch with heads of hair in coming spring of 92, still frozen, 
as the cockatoo is permed in high colored crests. Boom cars pass, powerful sound systems with gut punch on wheels. They move slowly, showily down the street, punching and punctuating the air regular with a 1-1 beat. This time, I'd like to present a performance piece by Terry Reed, something he put together quite a few years ago now. Uh, it's a uh, conceptual, visual, sculptural, it's photographic, uh, it's an art piece that also involves a young woman named Jacqueline and is best accompanied by the text that Terry wrote, uh, his artist's statement, if you will. As in the accompanying illustration, blow-ups of the three bathtub photos, jelly, 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 are displayed. The bathtub with jelly is also displayed. The bathtub is, however, not white, but black. The jelly is not red, but green, a reversed conjunction. This bathtub, as the object in real space, becomes the negative from which the prints have been made. The third dimension is forced into the frame of two. The concrete loses authority. The real confuses with image. One, photographs in bathtub may be displayed in sequence along a wall. Two, or preferably, the display is enclosed in a room. The floor space is proportionate to, but larger than the bathtub. This is the dark room black, lit red. Open drawers file, Terence Reed. Visionary Terence McKenna said, The main thing to understand is that we are imprisoned in some kind of work of art. I think Terence Reed would agree.